Good morning everybody. This morning I am off on a trip, an all day trip. It is just before 7am and I am waiting for a car or some kind of transport to come and pick me up and head out to, I think they call it the Golden Bridge. I've been told to bring a hat and water, but literally it is an all day tour starting at 7 a.m finishing at around 5 or 6 p.m and there's a lot of walking so yesterday i went out and bought a pair of trainers i walked past a bar and a lady was working there and i said where can i go and buy some cheap trainers and she opened up my google maps and put a pin down for me and it was a little local market so I walked down there, it was about a 25 minute walk and I managed to pick myself up a pair of trainers which was 170 Vietnamese dong. Made it onto the bus, I was the first person to be picked up. Good morning everyone. I mean, uh, to do myself, my name is Tony. Tony uh, in Vietnam, it means very handsome. Today, Tony, uh, very uh, pleased when I take you from your uh, hotel, uh, go to Banyu one day. We are on the Dragon Bridge. You can see Dragon Bridge. Tonight, I have the show on the Dragon Bridge, like prior and watering at 9 p.m. If you want to uh, see the show, you can uh, go to the Santa Night Market. Santa Night Market. You can uh, stand in on the Santa Night Market. The first stop is to a silk factory to see how the silk is made. So you can see, this is the silk for food. Yeah, here for food. Yeah, after seal one, after seal one, it's the memory really, about 17 days. And they make a cocoon like this. Yeah, and now uh, we have a white cocoon and the golden cocoon like this. This is a finger and move this with me. Yeah, yeah, it's very strong. Yeah, very strong. We just moved golden cocoon in the Poon River. Yeah, in the Poon River about 30 days. And we make flower like lavender. Arrive at Banan Hill. This is our group and we're just waiting for everyone to get together before we head in. So we've got 10 minutes to walk around and have a little look. And then we've got to head back to go and get our tickets. It is so hot, it's just ridiculous. About to get on the cable car now. Just about made it on board. <laughs> Our cable car is 4.8 kilometers long, but there is another one that goes right to the top, and that's six kilometers long. Oh, wow, it's very crowded. I'm lost for words really. Amazing.
I bet those views are stunning on a clear day. But it's right at the end of the burning season, so everything's still a bit cloudy. second cable car of the journey. I think this is a theme park now, which I'm not very good with. Yeah, on the top banner here we have three places you can visit. The first time you can go to the Moon Castle. Okay, and you can see this way. This way go to the amusement park. And number three, you can go this like this. This way. Go to the French village. Yay, it's lunch time. I'm so hungry. So I've got traditional Vietnamese lunch. You could have that or you could have Indian food, but I've gone for the traditional. I can honestly say that dinner was gorgeous. It really, really was. <laughs> and now I'm making my way back out. Now I'm on the train headed over to the 5D cinema. <laughs> I don't know why I put myself through it. Every time I go on a 4D cinema thing, I end up feeling sick. So why is it that I always want to climb to the highest point? That's because the way the best views are. I'm exhausted. I can't even speak. It's such a shame that it's the end of the burning season and everywhere is misty and smoky because the views from up here would be spectacular. They really, really would. I'm going to turn the camera around and let you see. So what do you think? <laughs> Worth the climb? <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> so the last thing is the French village. Time to go home. Oh.